So episode 66 is finally out, so today, let's try to make some of the skibbity toilet figures that appear in it here in Brookhaven. Oh, really? Before moving on, make sure you subscribe and write skibbity if you want me to make more videos like this one. So on this episode, we found three leading female characters. So to start making the first one, let's bring our female avatar, without any items, and then, open the ID box to start introducing ID code 1471. 741-9910 to get this cool top pink shirt and jacket, followed by ID code 1475-229-0433 to add the matching black bottom part. Then, open the accessories bar to search for Speaker Woman. Select this head, and also pick the Speaker Woman's headset. This really looks cool! Next, on the ID box, let's write code 1136-431-8324 so that we can place this sniper mobility backpack on our Speaker Woman back. It looks cool! Let's also open the color section and adjust our skin to black. And here we have our speaker woman. On episode 61, she seems to have new powers and appears dancing while listening to her own music. And her glowing speaker looks newer with special holes to launch objects and has high hills on her feet. She looks stylist. On the back, she does not have a jetpack, but probably a backpack amplifier. Next, let's try to make another female heroine. Let's deselect all her items. Next, we can open the ID box and introduce code 1419043. 8481 to get this camera woman black top part, followed by ID code 1419-049-3298 to get the matching pants. Then we should also write ID code 1419-607-6967 to get this normal CCTV rocket camera woman head from episode 52. But if you see ID code 1419-885-5660 you get the rocket camera woman but with active red face. She looks cool, right? For the third female figure let's continue using our female avatar without any items, and then, open the ID box to start introducing ID code 1409-178-1261 to get this black suit top for her, followed by ID code 1421-411-2085 to get the matching bottom part. Then let's open the color palette to adjust out skin to black, and when done, time to go to the accessories tab and search for a TV woman. There are so many options, but based on the episode let's pick this one. And here we have our TV woman. Time get my regular avatar back and let's introduce ID code 1485-031-8795 to place this TV speaker man head on our figure with some speakers on it as well. Now, for his outfit, let's introduce ID code 1413-496-1107 to add this bark suit with red shirt and black tie. Then we need to continue writing ID code 1458-470-1585. 1585 to get the matching black pants. Let's also go to the color section and adjust our skin to black. And to finish it up, let's go to the accessories area and search for a jetpack CCTV. Pick this one and here is our speaker man reading to join the other alliance members to fight against all the skibbity toilets. In the episode his jetpack seems to have a knife so maybe soon someone will create one with that. In the episode there is also a new character. To do it, deselect all the items so that then we can add ID code 591 519 6253 to place this badly made armored scientist tab shirt, following with ID code 56204086 to add the bottom part. After, we can add ID code 1439036-9046 to place the shinny TV on our scientist. What you think of him? Next, once we clear the previous my avatar, let's go to the ID box and introduce ID code 1390132-6430 to place this gray suit with white shirt and dots tie on our speaker man followed by ID code 1392-628-7105 to place the matching gray pants. Then we need to keep writing ID code 1426-399-7735 to place the speaker man head. And take a look! I think it is pretty close to the one that appears on episode 66. What do you think? Now, let's bring back our avatar and then, go to Roblox and look for a dark top like this one with ID code 924-245. 0171 and it looks perfect. Then let's also look for a chainsaw arms. There is no round one so let's add this one with ID code 1172-578-6489 and when done go back to Brookhaven and refresh the avatar and then go to the accessories area and look for the angry crystal crack and select the head so that it can be placed on our avatar. We also need to introduce ID code 1435-278 0460 to place these glasses on his face and next on the accessories area let's search for a cameraman's headset pick this one next let's go back to the id box and introduce id code 1458 470 1585 to get these black pants for our toilet and when done on the accessories area let's search for some toilet black select this one so that you can install the back of a toilet on our mutant's back so here we have our skibbity dark mutant version for our next character, 
let's go to Roblox and look for a dual plunger that is ID code 1430-507-9249. Lace it on our regular avatar and then go back to Brookhaven. Once here, deselect all my dependent dad items. Now open the accessory search bar and look for a plunger cameraman head. Pick this one. Looks perfect. Oh, I just realized that I should have kept the jetpack. Make sure you bring it back by using ID code 1419-420-7534. Now we're talking. Let's open again the accessories tab to search for Skibbity Glitch. It should give you this Glitch Toilet body part and also select the back of the Glitch Toilet. Cool, right? Next, simply open the ID box and include ID code 1423-092-6435 to get these add-on CCTV cables and then continue including ID 1380-328. 5267 to get this black top part for our cameraman, followed by ID code 1380-099-8172 to get the matching bottom black pants. Perfect! We will also need to introduce ID code 648-328-3962 to place this black pop collar on, and you see that it fits perfectly our avatar. Next, go to the accessories bat and look for some thunder aura and select this one, and this other one for the waist, along with this other one. Look how they fit around our character! Great! Then, let's continue by keeping introducing ID code 713-413-0839 to add this black split long coat. And here is the distinguished member of the black cameraman from episode 63, and he is known for his remarkable reflexes, strength, and bravery. If you want you can simply deselect the toilet pieces and our plunger will look a little different. Perfect! And if you delete the auras, he looks even simpler, right? Here we have our avatar back in time to try to make some more skibbity toilets. For that, let's open the accessories tab so that we can search for a soldier toilet, and we should select this bottom piece, and then the back matching one. And once we are here let's also look for a G toilet, and pick this other bottom part. Looking good! Next, let's write ID code 1411-313-3072 to place this creepy man head on our avatar. In the episode he has some black eyes, but since I couldn't find a code for that I decided to instead use ID code 1273-624. 6217 to place these shattered glasses instead on him to make it look that he was in a fight with the alliance. And to finish it up we just need to use ID code 220-824-6975 to change his top outfit. And here we have our skibbity toilet launcher before the speaker woman and TV woman got him on the head. And to continue with toilets, let's deselect all the items, and once done let's go to the accessories area and search for a rocket toilet bottom part. And once done, on the ID box we can introduce ID code 1351-072-0742 to place the skeevy cameraman head on the figure and let's change our skin color to black. Then, we can go back to the accessories tab and search for a helicopter. Select it and as you can see the helix is placed on top of our cameraman head. And here is another possible skibbity toilet. Please let me know what other figures I should try next and write more on the comments section as well. See you next time. Bye!